Hello and welcome to Audacity. You might notice this look is quite new. It's weirdly blue-purple. This is the latest version. Uh, well, let's see. This is uh, about Audacity. We have version 2.2.1. The point one doesn't play into this. But basically you have to get the latest Audacity version to get this new look. And now what we can do is we can switch to a dark theme. That's just great. I, I mean, it was totally possible on Linux and, I don't know, maybe Mac. But on Windows, I think it wasn't that easy. So, if we have any kind of sound wave, we can also change its color, by the way. If you use this drop-down menu here, uh, on the title of the audio track, you can change the wave color to red, green, and black, or dark gray. And default is instrument 1, aka blue. I guess you can probably change the settings somewhere. So that's for the visual of the sound wave. Yeah, let's switch to maybe maybe green. And to change the look of the entire application, we have to go to Edit, Preferences, and then an Interface. Down here, an Interface. We have Theme is Classic, Light, Dark, High Contrast, Custom. So Classic is Classic. Those weirdly rounded and uh, shaded buttons. I really got used to them though. But let's check out the other ones. Preferences, Interface, Classic Switch 2, or oh, Dark, we're gonna keep Dark for the, for the final one. High Contrast. Whoa, this is... Ha! <laughs> no, thank you. Alright, Preferences, Interface, and I guess we're gonna check out Dark now. Yeah, let's check out Dark. Ta-da! Oh man, this looks nice! Let's switch this to a different color. Wave color Oh, I don't know about this. I don't I don't know about that. Uh oh, this is not good. This is not too good. Oh, this is not good at all. Yeah. Uh yeah, okay. So these colors on the dark gray background are not very not very nice. Unfortunately, I can't think of the top of my head for a better suggestion. Also, these numbers down here are still blue. That's kind of ugly. Let's see if a restart helps. Nope, it's still blue. I guess they'll fix it in the next version. Hopefully. These buttons look nice, I have to say that. But then we have Edit Preferences and, uh, let's see, Interface... I no, Custom. Custom is interesting. But how to make a custom theme I'm going to show you in another video. So make sure to subscribe and see you in the next one. Okay, let's get back to dark. That is pretty cool, isn't it?